Line Shade is a really chilled out album. A collection of acoustic Americana that makes for a good evening listening when chilling out with your friends on your porch. Or, if you don't have one, sitting in silence and darkness reminiscing about that time. You know what I'm talking about, right? But despite what the scant information on Bandcamp says, this is not a mournful record. It does have a sad tinge to it, but it's not a collection of dirges. Why am I telling you about this obscure album? Who is it from? How crisp is it? Hello to Potters, this is Sam Mas, a guy with a master degree in music and the delusion that more than three of you actually care about good independent music that's not on the radio. You know, the musicians. Lion Shade is an album by The Wild Lones, a band that I know extremely little of. I found them while looking for more music by Sackville, the previous band of The Lones leader, Gabe Levine. Levin? Levine. Maybe. But that is a long story, so ask me in the comment section if you want to know more. This video needs to be short and to the point, right? The Wild Loans seem to be a one-off band. Knowing a bit about Levine through Google, apparently he's teaching in London, Ontario these days. This is a Canadian band. It features Levine on vocals and guitar, Scott Gilmore on dobro, drums, piano, cymbalon and glockenspiel, Mike Feuerstack on lap steel and vocals and finally Eric Tigra on bass and vocals. I wish I could assure you that the people you saw in those pictures are actually those playing in the album, but the truth is, I'm not sure. That's how small this band is. And yet, this nine track album has great moments. It starts magically with St. Louis Square, a song full of an intense, gentle, late night atmosphere, pensive. Sweet, it's great modern Americana. I particularly like the use of echo and reverb, which are used to add space and sparkle as the track goes on. There's a lot of examples of this way of building arrangements in Lion Shade. Songs start simply, often bare bones, just voice and guitar, and then other instruments chime in and build the track up. The second track is the best on the album. Out on the dance floor is happy, upbeat, a little gem. Feuerstock is on fire on the lap steel. He does everything you want to hear from the instrument and then some. On the following track, last words, I especially like Gilmour's use of cymbalum, that metallic beating sound that you hear every now and then, like a spinning fan hitting a metallic string. The song itself, it's sad and melancholic, the first real downer of the album. Not that it is bad, mind, it's just a bit depressing. A happier song after it, would have counterbalanced the mood and given the listener a good payback. Unfortunately, the following songs are all pensive and slow. This is where the building up in the arrangements I was telling you about is mostly heard. Now, these songs are nice by themselves, but in the context of the album, the listener comes off a bit fatigued by all the placidity and sadness. Thankfully, the album ends on a strong couple of songs. Slide Away is positively country, almost starting out like Dire Straits' Ticket to Heaven before verging immediately in a completely different territory. and Paradise in Bloom offers a nice conclusion to it all. It is pensive, it is bare start followed by a meteor arrangement, but it's also upbeat and somewhat more hopeful than anything else on the album, except from Out on the Dance Floor, that is. Perhaps with a couple more upbeat songs, 
in addition or substituting, say, in the stockyards of your heart or security song, and maybe a reshuffle of the track list, those things could have just opposed the lights and shadows a bit better, making this album extremely strong as it is. I think it's still worth your attention, even when the music drags a bit. Line Shade is for you if you like acoustic Americana or if you want music that slows everything down and makes you breathe the magic in the world. Line Shade is not for you if you want something lively for a party or if you're driving at night. Too much relax at the wheel. Wake up! As usual, support the channel any way you can with a donation, a like, or even sharing your opinions in the comment section. If you want to listen to Lion Shade for free, the link is in the video description. Likewise, if you want to get to my free Telegram channel, check out the link or this QR code. If you like this video, you want to get there as soon as possible to get more exclusive listening advice. Keep your eyes open for more music related content. For the moment, stay cool and keep your top hat on. Bye!